This is whey protein, specifically whey isolate. And I use it every day as nutritionist because it has a lot of insane benefits that you honestly probably haven't even heard of. Today I'm going to share with you guys the 10 really unique benefits of whey protein powder and why I use it as a nutritionist. And the first is that it's one of the highest quality protein powders. There's something called a diaz score, which rates how well various proteins are actually absorbed from your small intestine and into your body. This is a really important scoring system when it comes to how good a protein actually is. Because if you can't absorb it, then you obviously can't use it. To be considered an excellent or high quality protein, you need a diet score of one or higher. And then something that's considered just like a good protein would be 0.75 to 0.99. And then if you're below 0.75 on the diet score, super low quality protein. And whey proteins range from one to even 1.2, meaning it's really digestible and a really high quality protein versus something like soy protein, which only has a diet score of 0.9. And you could even look at something like pea protein, which only has a diet score of 0.9. 0.62. So with a whey protein, you actually get full utilization of the protein. In other words, you get like more bang for your buck, which if you're new here, my name's Autumn. I'm a certified clinical nutritionist with my master's nutrition, human performance. Okay. The second reason that I use whey protein is because it's the rich source of leucine. Leucine is an amino acid and it's the most important amino acid when it comes to actually stimulating new muscle growth. And I know you would think like from my massive guns that I don't need to stimulate any more muscle, but it's something I've been working on. Leucine is the most important amino acid when it comes to recovery recovering from your workouts, because if you aren't recovering from your workouts and you're just breaking your muscle down and that actually can lead to increased insulin resistance, making it harder to achieve a weight loss goal. So since it's such a high quality protein and really great for muscle repair, it also can help to prevent muscle fatigue from your workout as well. And even if you aren't looking to massively increase your muscle mass, you still need leucine to repair any type of protein within the body. This can be literally from an injury or a wound or the muscles that make up the lining of your intestines or your heart. You want to make sure that when you're having a protein that you're actually getting the full usage out of it by having a protein that's rich in leucine. Okay, third, specifically to whey, it helps to enhance the immune system. Specifically, whey protein contains two really important peptides, first called alpha lactalbumin and the second beta lactoglobulin. And both have been studied to actually enhance the immune system and lymphatic responses. Not to mention beta lactoglobulin, which say that 10 times fast, <laughs> may also even help speed up wound healing. Now, the fourth reason I use whey protein is because it's high in tryptophan. Tryptophan. tryptophan is another amino acid and it's actually been found to help improve brain function when under stress or in other words cognitive performance when under stress fifth reason why i use whey protein but specifically whey protein isolate is because it's very very low in lactose in fact it's so low in lactose that generally speaking most who are lactose intolerant can use whey protein isolate and not experience any gi issues this is actually why i personally chose whey protein isolate to make my own protein powder which is being released very soon i'm really excited about it because whey protein on its own already has so many great benefits, but whey protein isolate is so low in lactose that makes it a good option for most people. And I'll be releasing all the details of my whey protein isolate, zero sugar pasture raised protein powder coming really, really soon. Oh my God, quick update. I literally just picked up all the protein powder. That's why I'm so sweaty. We will officially be releasing it on Monday on my email newsletter, on Instagram, on Facebook, and of course on YouTube. But if you wanna make sure that you're the first one to get notified on when it is officially released, make sure that you subscribe to the weekly newsletter, link down description below. That's where everything will be announced right away. Or you could just like check in on my website every like five minutes or so. Who knows, maybe I'll put it up earlier. That was a terrible wink. Okay, back to the video. <laughs> okay, the sixth reason I use whey protein is because it's anti-inflammatory. It's literally been studied to reduce inflammation. There's a large review of multiple studies that found taking the equivalent of 20 grams of whey protein per day, which is the amount that my protein powder has, <laughs> significantly reduces something called CRP. And this is one of our main markers of inflammation within the body. Now, the seventh reason I use whey protein is because it has really great antioxidant effects. Whey protein is also uniquely high in an amino acid called cysteine, and cysteine is is absolutely crucial for making our internal antioxidant called glutathione. And the antioxidants that we eat, like vitamin C, are no match for our internal glutathione when it comes to how powerful the antioxidant is. And glutathione is also crucial in liver detoxification, specifically phase two liver detox. And whey protein has been found in numerous studies to really help to increase our glutathione production, probably because it is so high in cysteine. And as a result, reduce oxidative stress. Okay, the eighth reason I use whey protein is because it's really great for body recomposition. 
protein. And protein in general is really great for body recomp, which is where you're losing body fat or gaining or maintaining muscle mass. And because whey protein is such a high quality protein and we're able to absorb and use so much of it and it has such a rich source of leucine, we're actually able to get the most bang for our buck for body recomposition goals. Okay, the ninth reason that I use whey protein is that it may help even improve bone health. Osteoporosis is a really big problem as we age. And it's something that we haven't talked as much about on my channel, but it's so important to discuss now, especially if you're in a position to prevent future osteoporosis. Osteoporosis is essentially bone loss. It's where your bones get literally porous -y, like a sponge, and therefore really fragile. And you're more likely to experience things like hip fractures that can be debilitating when you're older. And two of the best lifestyle factors to help improve bone density is to incorporate strength training and make sure that you're getting high quality sources of protein. Because bones are mostly made out of protein. And in fact, it's a common concern with weight loss that if you're not getting enough high quality protein in, in, the body will start to pull amino acids from muscle as well as bone, resulting in decreased bone density, and therefore future increased risk of osteoporosis. So especially if you have a weight loss goal, you wanna make sure that while you're losing weight, you're getting enough protein to not only maintain your muscle mass, but also to help maintain bone health. And one meta-analysis found that whey protein specifically might be beneficial for improving bone mineral density. Tenth reason why I use whey protein is because it's extremely easy to use. Because I know it's a high quality source of protein from the diascore and the leucine, as well as tryptophan and cysteine, content, I know that I can add it to pretty much anything and help to significantly boost my high quality protein source. So I love to put it in my smoothies or chia puddings or grain free oatmeal, or if I have a sweet tooth, but I don't really want to eat sugar, I'll make things like protein waffles or protein pancakes. In fact, I have been working on my own zero sugar whey protein isolate for the past multiple months now, and it's almost ready and I'm so excited. <laughs> it's really cool because the whole community from the start has been super involved on picking what types of ingredients and what type of benefits we're really looking for with this protein powder. And it's been really fun for you guys along the journey during this whole process of making my protein powder. I especially feel like I've seen women not taking advantage of all the really amazing health benefits that go along uniquely with whey protein. So I wanted to make sure I created a zero sugar, high quality protein option that's really low in lactose to support not just weight loss goals, but also health goals too. So if you wanna stay in the loop for when that's officially released, which will be very soon, you can subscribe to my weekly newsletter that's linked down description below. That's where I'll be announcing it right when it's released. In the meantime, if you want some recipe inspo, this recipe has been wildly popular with the community. You can check it out right here. Also, if you're new to my channel and you love this science-backed information, make sure you subscribe right here. Come out with new videos every Tuesday and Thursday. All right guys, thanks so much for tuning in and I'll see you in my next video.